Okay, welcome to part three of the basic full flash site structure in ActionScript 3. And we've been talking about how to make a full site in Flash with the menu system and page system. Uh, page movie clips and menu movie clip that'll uh, navigate through your full Flash file. And uh, just want to mention to you guys real quick that you see I use the uh, tutorial file for the animated button symbols and uh, you could use the drop down menu same thing because it's a movie clip itself just like the button menu and we're gonna it's gonna be scripted in a similar way okay so um, now we're making the services movie clip so let's just go ahead and go into the library and where's that about page let's go ahead and right click duplicate that one also and we're gonna call this one the um, videos call it videos press OK and we gotta make one more because we have four buttons there four pages in our site this is a really small site and um, let's go back to about right click duplicate and let's call this one contact and that'll be a contact us page and we'll press OK and also keep in mind that uh, mp3 players can be laid in here and if you want an mp3 song to play on your while their people are perusing your site you would just put it in this timeline here where your background your button menu movie clip is and your logo and header maybe put it up there in your header and you can go to our tutorial for a uh, full screen flash site put the full screen button right there and make your uh, site full screen okay let's go back into our pages movie clip and finish up okay so on the services section we're going to put a keyframe there and there'll be the contents of the about us page there and we can just swap that out because that's what we want now we go to swap and we're going to call this uh, or swap it out for the which one the videos page so this isn't going to be services this is going to be videos forget services we don't have any services all we have is videos okay so we have the videos page set up here and here's the videos clip and it should say videos down there in the instance identifier now you can go in and safely since we swapped it out safely uh, change everything up inside of it welcome to my video page Actually, we're not even going to leave this text here because I'm going to go to develop PHP and download the video playlist player tutorial. And aren't you guys glad that I put everything, I nest everything into movie clips when I make it? That way you can just go to the file, open it when you download this tutorial, highlight that on the main scene there, highlight everything, press control C and go into the new site and here we are inside of our video page movie clip let's pop this bad boy in and you can see it's too big for my site but that's okay I don't care your site wouldn't be this small so it would fit in just nice but I'm just showing you an example of how you can throw anything you want into these pages movie clips you know what I'm saying scrollers mp3 players uh, movie players um, you name it image galleries whatever you want contact forms so let's just go ahead and get rid of that one and let's bring that text back but I was just doing that to show you an example okay welcome to my video page but if I left that thing there my site was big enough to hold it um, it would play the videos okay so um, now we have a videos page let's go out of that one make our press F6 create motion tween by right clicking the center and select create motion tween and now we're gonna put our stop action by pressing F6 F9 and then type it in the stop action okay now we have a one more to go so we'll put a label here and call this contact because this is gonna be our contact page and then Bring that one out. Let's 
let's put a keyframe right there by pressing F6 then press F9 and let's type in our final stop action and if you had eight pages you just keep going on and on fifteen pages keep going on and on and on eight million pages just keep going on and on and on down through there okay so we'll give this a keyframe this content there is a video page make sure you swap it for the one that says contact contact now we can go ahead and tween it create motion tween and now um, we can go inside of the contact movie clip and just write contact us now welcome to my contact page okay that's it now we have all four and let's make sure we have our alphas set correctly to where they all fade in and they have a little transition effect and there are bunches and bunches of transitions that you can figure out to do inside of here you can have uh, screens that come in and out you can have uh, little circles that would uh, fade out of the way to bring in your content little squares uh, masking all kind of cool techniques you can use for transitions but this one is pretty cool because it's just a fading in and fading out and it, it makes for a nice clean quick uh, smooth page transition for this demonstration okay so let's get rid of all these frames since we don't need them the file won't be going past that so let's remove frames so highlight and remove frames and now that's it the inside of our contact us movie clip is done or uh, the pages movie clip is done so let's see on the videos page let's go ahead and add a movie clip to that oops the videos page make sure we highlight that go into the movie clip that is the video movie clip the video page movie clip let's bring our digital clock tutorial well maybe not digital clock let's see what else do we have here alright well you guys get the idea you can put whatever you want in there um, so that's it for that I do believe and if you wanted your background to be different colors on each page here here's our background layer you would just make keyframes there and make it red make keyframe here make it blue that way when it gets to that spot it changes to that color but that would be kinda cheesy but I was just saying for demonstration purposes you know just so you can get in there and experiment with all kind of stuff you know uh, alright so now we double click out of that by double clicking on the blank space here and now you'll be in the timeline that is uh, the logo and header pages button menu and background now the button menu layer is where our buttons are so let's go ahead and go inside of uh, first before we do that let's take our pages movie clip and give it an instance name of all pages now it has an instance name so now we can talk to it with action script and control it so we'll go inside of the button menu now by double clicking this movie clip and now we will continue the uh, the rest and final part of the tutorial in part 4 and uh, we'll code out the buttons and show you how to go inside that pages movie clip using this button menu that's in its own separate movie clip and we'll have them talking back and forth okay We'll see you next lesson in the final one, number four.